Hi, and welcome to another how-to tutorial for Windows 7. In this tutorial, I will show you how you can change the default folder location for the default Windows folders such as your picture folder, video folder, music folder, your downloads folder, and your My Documents folder. I run a solid state hard drive. What I like to do is keep my pictures on my regular hard drive and keep that type of stuff off the solid state hard drive. So when I go to my pictures folder, let me click on it. You know, I don't have my actual pictures in here, but this is actually really easy to change. You right click on the word pictures, okay? You click properties, and here you have library locations. So I will actually pick my default picture folder location so I'll click on include a folder this is my picture folder on my regular hard drive so I'm included I just apply that so now I'm just go back okay now you can see that here are my picture folders okay but since these are my default folders I would like these placed on top. So once again, I'm going to click on properties. And I can simply just drag that to the top. And you see this check mark? This indicates that this is the save location. I don't want to save pictures to my C drive, which is my SSD drive. So I'm going to select the D drive. And I'm going to select set save location. So now my new pictures will be saved to this location. I just click apply. So as you can see, when I click on my pictures, it goes to the proper folder and the other ones are below. And you can also remove these if you never use them. The same goes for the documents folder. I already rerouted this one. Um, so I can show you the music folder. So once again, I hit properties. Remove this right here and I want to include a folder um, actually okay I'll click this so I'll include that folder I'll hit apply so now you know the new location is displayed and if I want to move it up I just drag it there and click apply so now that folder is my default location okay that's it for this tip if you have any computer related questions or you would like a video procedure on something go ahead and post a comment right below this video and make sure you subscribe to my channel so that you'll be notified when I post another useful tip take care